Greetings, fellow portal masters. Greetings, fellow portal masters. I'm Crash Rouser, and it's once again time to Crash Guns with another episode. Ooh. Boom, baby. Of the Skylander Giants retry here on the channel. Giant Lock retry here on the channel. Skylander Giants Giant Lock retry. I'll probably say that right at some point. Cut that out. Just kidding. I edit these videos. And I don't cut anything out. Sometimes I forget to completely edit things out. Yeah. Regardless, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for coming back watching another episode of this series. We're at episode 4 of this one. Hopefully there's going to be 16 episodes of this series. The Giant Locks so far are going pretty well. We have a couple Skylars that are yet to debut. So hopefully this episode we will. And if you guys want more description of what this show or series is all about definitely check the description down below it's the best way to describe it on with the playlist for the past episodes of the giant lock and the few the old series because this is actually a second try of me trying the giant's lock so let's not waste any more time and get into episode four which is the cutthroat carnival which is so funny because four years later this this level gets referenced in another skylander game technically five years later because it was after when Robo got released, they mentioned this, so. I know it's hard to believe, Callie, but there are uh, some people in this town who, how shall I put this, Ooh. don't like me very much. <laughs> Gee, I wonder why. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, I wonder why. No, you're not good at that. I mean, I'm good at it. I'm good at talking. He's like, he's like, eh? Handy. We heard that you're handy at preparing ships. Uh, that's yeah. Ah, uh, help you I can, <laughs> but I'm not gonna work for free. And your money's no good here. You'll need to pay me in pirate chips. Okay. How do we get these pirate chips? You must win a few rounds of Sky Stone. Something we locals like to play. Sky Stones. Never heard of it. It's bouncer time. I just got like a big old clump of aloe. Oh, what is this? What is going on here? Hold on. What is this going on up here? My hair doing a little. Oh. My hair doing a little dancey dance on the top there. All right. <laughs> Crash, I've noticed every episode you look more and more homeless. Thank you. It's because I keep forgetting to either shave or cut my hair. Legitimately forgot to cut my hair, get my hair cut um, when I got paid this week. Are you impressed with me, though? Like, are you are you surprised along with that? Like, are you like, oh, Crash, that's totally you. What are you guys doing? Don't you dare drop down there. Yeah, drop down. There you go. No, you can't fight me. <laughs> Wait, did I kill the other one? Oh, I must have if that thing popped up. Elio. Or the game glitched out and said, hey, ya boy, you know. Life element, let's go! Tree Rex time, baby. Tree Rex it up. Tree Rex it up. I think um, we are going to have at least one debut this episode, if I'm not mistaken. But I remember correctly, there is a fire element switch. And I think after this, water element switches too. Oh, I didn't mean to skip that. I'm sorry, everybody. Please, please forgive. Let me know in the comments I'm a big jerky jerk face. Question of the day, is Crash a big jerky jerk face? That's not the question of the day, that's an alternate question of the day. Cause I'm gonna I'm gonna try to edit these videos kind of together. It's not gonna work. It's me we're talking about here. So Oh, oh, oh do you see that head though? You see Blobber's head? Blobber's What a dummy. Or, or, better yet, I'll go win it back. Alright. Excuse me. My favorite thing is that the guy is like, Nice, you lost Sky... You know what's funny? Like, this guy, this guy we fight for Sky Stones, teaches us how to play Sky Stones. So you can imagine how bad he actually is. So then imagine how bad Blobbers is at this game. 
Like, how bad can Blobbers be at Skystones if he loses to the guy that teaches you how to play Skystones, and then you beat him in Skystones? Everybody goes Skystone team. This is my Skystone team. I just let him autofill. <laughs> I think this guy has like nothing but spiderlings though, so. Spiderlings. Another spiderling? Go on. Archean Jouster. Archean Jouster. Archean Chouster, am I right? Look at that. We're gonna go in a, I, I think we're actually, we might be going in a perfect square, which would be hilarious. Oh my god, we're going in a pervy square. Bro, I don't think I've ever seen that happen in this game. We're gonna have the entire outer ring. That's so cool. I've never seen that before. That's so cool. I got the entire outer ring. I've never seen that. I've never done that in this game before. Fuego Chompy? Fuego? Fuego Del Sol from, A from AEW? Crash, you an AEW fanboy? I'm a wrestling fanboy. There's a difference. I like all of it. I like wrestling. I like watching people beat each other up. I think it was still life there then. Yeah. Bang, bang, boom. You shoot him, baby. And you go, Clonkus. You go, Clonkus. And you go, Clonkus. And then you go, Clonkus. And then you shoot, 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 shoot. And then he misses you. And then you go, Clonkus. And then you go, Clonkus. Like, what the? Like, I don't get it. Um, Brock didn't last that long, but th as I remembered, um, I don't know, I think I said it in the video, but just to make sure, um, Brock, or sorry, Eyebrawl, I do have him completely maxed in all the, um, like, Heroic Monday stuff, too. <laughs> I say Heroic Monday stuff, too, but it's just the, the Heroic Challenges. Yay! Hi, Blobbers! You gonna tell me I got the key? I think, yes, Water Element, baby. It's time for the debut of Thump Back. Shout out to Thumplander on YouTube. Yeah, I got any more than frames? My god, he dropped. Wee! <laughs> Look at that. I just. Wee! Right into him here. Clunkus! <laughs> Clunkus! <laughs> nah, nice dude. That's some freaking nice there. Wee! <laughs> I'm hitting him. I think I killed him. I did too. Let's go. Let's give him the chompy now. Let's go. Chomp. 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 Look at that. I thought you might be able to use an extra hand here. It's going to take some heavy artillery oh, sorry. to blow through that game. Oh, yeah? Looks like that galleon might have all the firepower we need. What about if you look up your butt? Let's use your giant strength to pull the ship in with that chain. What about if I don't want to do that? Just kidding. I definitely want to do that. And then while I'm at it... <gasps> Feel strength! Crash, doesn't that hurt your voice when you do that? Yes, very. But no. I've been doing... I've been doing, like, metalcore growls my entire life. So, like, I've practiced ever since I was, like, I think in like grade 11 was when I actually focused on learning how to do it properly because I had a friend of mine who was really good at doing them so he actually taught me like the proper way to do growls instead of ripping my vocal cords apart because that's the biggest issue with it right you see a lot of these like metal screamers and bands like I like to point at Bring Me The Rise and the biggest one like um Ollie Sykes the lead singer of the band he here's here's Crash with random tangents again um he, he's not really screaming as much anymore because of the fact that his vocal cords are so messed up. Same with, like, Danny Warsnop of Asking Alexandria. 
Like, they, they've reduced their screaming because of the fact that they've ripped their vocal cords up so much. Is that fire? That was fire, baby! They have all debuted. Hothead making his debut. Maybe this series, Hothead will actually uh, be around with other Skylanders to take on Drill X. You can't, you can't say that. Oh my gosh, you can't say that. Yeah? Mm. Oh yeah? Breaking them out. I thought the um the dude in the background was still running into the gate. I don't know if you guys noticed that. He was like running into the gate the entire time. Don't know why I went to the left there when I clearly hit right, but that's fine. I think my controller might have a um what's it called? One of those loose sticks? Or like uh, what's it called? Stick drift? I think it does. And luckily it doesn't affect me in like any of these games. It would affect me in a game like this, for example, where I'm ready to press A and I go to the left by accident, but I don't I literally don't play anything else on my Xbox, so. Oh, I can't do anything else. Okay, we're going up here then. I should have saved it. Oh no, where am I? Yeah, I should have saved it. I'm not doing this, by the way. Alright, we win though. That's see, that's what I meant just then. It like it was going to the left and it was going burr, 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 like that. I was not holding left. Why would I be holding left? Thanks for the chompy card. Let's -a go. Okay. There we go. I burped. Woohoo! Oh, I got hit head on there, bro. I'm not even mad. I legitimately just let him just clonk me then. But that's fine. Look at the executioner's run away. I know. I fought him so many times now. Let's go. <laughs> but I'll also stand directly in this way. In the way, so you can't go this way first. Because if you want to go this way, then I'm not allowing it. It's rain and stuff. Just kidding, it's rain and stuff. Oh yeah. Easy. Easy murders then. Clunkus. Okay, let me just do this. Ah. Ooh, lots of food though. I'll take that. Can I hit you guys down here? Oh wait, can I do this? Yeah, it's raining, baby! So you gotta say, like, the variety of moves I can get with certain Skyliners in this game, that's gonna be a game, it's gonna be a game changer for me, man. Uh, uh, uh. Itchy. Now, thank you for moving slightly to the left! I appreciate that! Now I can actually continue in my game! Thanks, Callie! Easy! Look at that, I'm not even worried. I'm not even worried. Like, I'm actually, like, doing pretty well right now. I gotta say, like, I haven't had a single chance of me, like, getting, coming out with a case of the dead. You can open the gate. Really? Thank you, Callie. I was just gonna take the key and go, go pawn it. I was gonna go pawn it in the, in the pawn shop. I didn't know I was gonna use to open the gate. I was gonna go down to the road and be like, hey, you wanna buy a key? And they'd be like, yeah, sure. Here's a $5. I'm like, wow, what a deal. $5 for a key? Imagine. You can go get a key cut for like a dollar twenty-five at a place here in town. Like when we moved into our spot, I went and got two keys done, and it cost me two dollars and fifty cents. And I'm just like, what? But then, like, there's a professional shop, hilariously, where I close to where I work. Oh, life element, tree rex, like so close to where I work, and they were they were doing it for four dollars a key, cutting keys for four dollars. Like, what the heck? I don't get it. I think it's because that one was privately owned, so they can, you know, try to get away with it. Get on me, 
So the good news is, is after you kill all of his old friends here, that I'm <laughs> basically one-shotting every one of them. Executioners, just kidding, they're gonna die. Oh my god. I'm tearing through them, I don't get it. Is it because, because I know there's a couple of the Skylanders I have, the Giants, that aren't um, fully, aren't leveled up to level 20 in the other games, but some of them are like Tree Rex, uh, Swarm, and Eyebrow all are, for example. Like, does that make a difference when it comes to their strength? Or do they get, like, nerfed because of the game they're in now? Now, we did it! We beat this level. All we gotta do is just beat this level of Skystones, and that's it. Yeah, so that's four, four levels down now. Because if you beat Skystones, if you don't do it, he's just like, ha ha ha, and then you gotta play it again, that's all. I love how the fact that he was legitimately going to rob you and kill you. And you're just like, nah, no biggie, man. Let's go play some Skystones, bro. Let's go, man. Right? Like I said, it's all good. Let's just play, play some Skystones, baby. Skystones Overdrive is still my favorite version of Skystones. Future video right there. Top five Skystone games. Because there's only five of them. Because I don't like I don't really like Skystone Smash. This is the OG Skystones. Uh we'll do top. Yeah, look at that. Four, four, one, baby. Five, one now. Oh, he's going to take that one, though. And did not take this one. That's game. There's no way he's going to get it now. So all he's left is the Fuego Chompy, and he's not going to be able to... Oh. That was a joust. Oh, he died. He came down with a case of the dead. This guy's still collected. Ooh, that was actually not a bad one, Clunk. That was excellent. That was accident. You tell him that he still owes me. He still owes me. There you go. All done, says I. Yep. Your ship's engine is repaired and ready for sale. Though I must warn you, I've heard tales of this very vessel before, and it's pretty impressive. Yeah, we know. And it's about to get a lot more impressive with Skyland's most amazing pilot. Back at the helm. Boom! Wait. Wait a minute! That's where I know you from! You're Captain Flynn! And you once borrowed five gold pieces from me and never gave it back! No, I'm pretty sure that was someone else. <laughs> what am I saying? No one else could possibly be this handsome! Come back here, you swine! <laughs> Pay for it? And I love this part. Because knowing what we know now, it's hilarious that that actually did lead to something. But when that happened, you're like, oh, why is why did that dramatic music come up, right? But now we know that that actually leads to his giant breakthrough in... The Lost Imaginate Minds, if you guys haven't seen that, because you hang out with Blobbers, and he talks about how Skylands is always pushing him around and bullying him and stuff, and then he gets yeeted out into existence. But yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. Four levels down, only 12 more to go. Let's hope we can do it. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching this episode of the Giant Lock Retry. Let me know in the comments below your answer to the question today, and just general chat. Say, hey, Crash, you're doing good. It's always nice to see him doing something right. And another easy way to show that is hitting the like button. Of course, seeing that is another way of supporting the channel. It also shows that I'm doing something right. And that's the biggest thing is I want to make sure I'm doing all right for you guys. I'll see you all next week for another awesome episode. Y'all mean the world so we don't ever forget it. But as always, I bid you farewell.